Hello, hello, friends. It's Tuesday and it's Crafty Tuesday. Welcome, welcome. All the Oh, I see some people are already here. Hi, Kristen and Renee, Roseanne. Roseanne, I saw you at the expo. It was so nice to meet you in person. Oh my gosh, you guys are already chatting it up. Oh, you guys are working on your banner for Delanda. Started watching, but dinner was ready. Um, is this your your cricket banners that you guys are making, or is it any banner? It's just oh, it's your your word. I think that's what you guys are working on. Um, well, hello, welcome to Crafty Tuesday. I'm Courtney Brickner with the Crafty Brick. Welcome, Crafty Tuesday is, you know, it's just something that I like to do to share the other side of crafting that is not all ready and practiced and perfected and ready for social media. It's just, you know, we, we see what happens on Crafty Tuesday. We never know how it's going to be, if it's going to be a good project or if it's going to be a bad. Actually, I'm not going to say bad project. I don't think any of the projects are bad. It's just that we kind of learn what works and some things work and some things don't. So that's what Crafty Tuesday is all about. So if you're here wanting to know exactly how to do something, this is probably not the right place for you. But if you are here to have some fun, laugh with me, see if I can make this project work um, and see if it's good, then welcome. This, this is the place. <laughs> oh, word of the year. That's what it was, Kristen. Um, what is, what is y'all's word of the year? Hi, Tina. Hi, Lucille. Tarsha, welcome to Crafty Tuesday. You guys, look what I have behind me. I am so excited. I'm actually going to use Romeo tonight. So we're going to see how that goes. I have an idea and I'm going to try it out. So I don't, I don't know. Oh, create. Kristen, look what I made today. Create. I wanted a sign to go in this empty spot right here because I guess I want to fill every spot on my wall, but I went with create as well. I like that. I like to create. So I'm creating with you, Kristen. I don't know if it will hang up. Ah, the nail is falling in to the wall. Okay. There, my create sign. Oh, you watch Sweet Rose Hustle. Um, thanks for watching the baddies video. That was that was an interesting little get together. I don't know if y'all saw. I ended up crying. We all ended up crying. Oh my goodness, I'm not even a crier. And there I was crying on live. I told my husband, he was like, What? <laughs> you did what? Yeah, I was crying. I don't know. It's a good group of ladies. So we had a good time. So if you missed that, you can check out the um, the Business Baddies Roundtable. I was live earlier. This is crazy. This week, so I was live earlier today. I'm live now. I'm going live again tomorrow. It's it's a live week. Create by either crafting or creating new experiences. I love that, Kristen. You know, something that my husband and I are doing this year, so along with creating new experiences. So we've been married gosh, 20, almost 22 years. And um, we've been together 25. And I just feel like, oh my goodness, we just, we get kind of bored sometimes. We're doing all the kids stuff. And then, you know, we go out sometimes, but I feel like we're always like, well, what are we going to do? I don't know. What do you want to do? What do you want to do? I don't know. And so I decided this year, we are creating new experiences. So I will be show, showing y'all, but every month, we are going to take turns picking a date night and it has to be something that we haven't done before. So I've got January. I actually have this weekend. I can't share what it is right now because I don't want him to hear. He might, he might tune in or something, but I will share after we do it, but you have to plan the whole date night. And then um, he's got next month. He's very scared about it. He thinks he's not going to come up with a good idea but I have confidence in him to do something good for February. So I will be filling y'all in on what we, what we plan.
But I, I have my date night already planned for this week and I'm excited. I had to make a reservation for it. It's something we've never done. So I will let y'all know how it goes. <laughs> Let's see, hi, Miss C. Oh, and up designs growth. I like that for a word too. And Renee, what did you choose? Um, so emotional this morning. Oh, Renee was there. Yes, you you saw how emotional. Oh, sweet Rose, you were quiet, crying with us. Oh my gosh, we were all a hot mess. It was, you know, just lots of love going around the round table this morning. It was really good. Oh, you chose create too? We all did create, hey. All right, let me show y'all what we're planning on doing tonight. Let's, let's get into the craft. Oh my gosh, Brace Creative, we had you crying too. We were all crying. It was, it was crazy. We had such a good weekend. You know, it's not often that you meet a group of girls that you just really vibe with. And we did, we met last summer. They, some of them knew each other already, but I met all of them last summer and we just hit it off. So it's been really, really nice. Okay, so I don't know if you all have ever done this. Um, that, <laughs> I just don't know if this is gonna work. Okay, so I got Romeo here, but Romeo doesn't come with a 24 by 24 inch mat, but he does cut 24 by 24. You guys have never seen, you've never seen Juliet out, you've never seen Romeo out on my counter, but now that I got Romeo, I decided that I want them sitting on the counter all the time because they're so pretty, <laughs> both of them, and now they're together. The long lost lovers are together. So they're just gonna be on my counter all the time. So you're gonna always see them. <laughs> but I don't have a 24 by 24 inch mat. I thought Romeo came with that, but he doesn't. He comes with a 12 by 12. So I'm making a doormat. Let me show you my doormat. It's this size, it's 30 inches um, long. So it's Crafty Tuesday, so we're gonna see. I'm gonna tape two mats together. So I have two 12 by 24 inch mats. And my design is 26, actually 26 or 27 inches long. And I looked at Juliet and if I turn it to the side, I can actually fit it on this 24 inch mat. So the plan is to see if I can tape these mats together I really don't know. I I would I have no idea. Taping mats together is probably not the best idea, but I don't I just want to see if it will work. And it's Crafty Tuesday, so we're gonna check it out. Hey Katrina! Welcome to Crafty Tuesday. I'm trying to see if I can tape some mats together to make a 12 by 24 inch mat. So I don't know if Romeo is not going to be happy with this uneven surface in the middle. I'm not sure. Have y'all ever taped mats together? Maybe we can start with that and see if this is completely insane. I figure, I mean, it's going to be taped on here. And then my material is going to be on top of it. I'm going to tape the front and the back so it will hopefully be steady. I decided to go with masking tape instead of um, duct tape. I figured it would be a little bit thinner. Have you made this before, Crafty Bick? It dyed my steps. I have made it before. Today I'm actually making it with freezer paper. I've never used freezer paper. I used HTV last time I made it and it was kind of a hot mess. It ended up working out, but it was not like the simplest project ever. So I'm trying, I know people have tried the freezer paper, so that's what I'm trying out tonight. So we're gonna see if it works. All right, I need to make sure that there's no tape kind of sticking out with spots that will make it stick in place and get stuck. Oh goodness, all right. So here we are. I have taped together two mats and we're gonna, we're gonna see. We're gonna see if this is gonna work. Let's see. Katrina, they said they were crying with us this morning. <laughs> we were all crying. Why are you saying sorry? What happened? What happened? What happened, Missy? Oh, that it died or step. 
It did not die my steps. What did you use, Miss C, when you, last time I used this outdoor paint and it definitely did not dye my steps, but it also has a very thick backing. So I don't think it's gonna dye it. All right, so I'm going to put this on. Let's see if this is enough. I don't even know if this is actually going to be wide enough. Now that I've taped this together, let's see. I want it to be long, long wide. All right, all right, guys, let's see. Let's put this down. Let me, um, let me move this other camera so y'all can see what I'm doing. Can't really see over there. All right, so I've got my big spot here. Hey, Marissa, welcome to Crafty Tuesday. Masking tape is thin and tear easy. Be careful. We're going to see. We shall see if this works. It's Crafty Tuesday, so that's what we do. So I'm going to try it out for y'all. And then we will know if taping that together is a good idea or not. And I'm going to show you in Leonardo Design Studio how I'm setting this up to see if it works. I'm just cutting that so that doesn't, um, I don't know, mess with the size of the cut. Okay, it's on here now. Let's see. It doesn't even seem like it's sticking that well to this mat. Probably because my mats are um, not very sticky. <laughs> so there is a little bump in the middle, so I don't know if that's gonna throw off what we're trying to do here. But we shall see. Okay. Hey, Vern. Welcome to Crafty Tuesday. All right. So let me present here. You did, Vern. Look, Romeo is right here. We're using him tonight. So excited. Okay. I'm going to share my screen, the entire screen. All right, I got a whole bunch of stuff open here. But here is my doormat. And I am working with this 12 by 24, or 24 by 24 mat. So what I wanna do, I'm going to um, ungroup those. I'm gonna group those, to, I'm gonna group them together in two lines because they're not gonna fit together on the on the mat but actually let me see so that's 25 inches i want to go 28 so we're going to see so they're separate i'm moving that one off the mat we're turning this one sideways all right all right we are about to see if this works so this wouldn't even fit on the regular mat, you know, if we were, if I was just cutting it because the biggest it could be is 24 inches, but we're going to see if it will fit right here. Let's, let's check it out. All right. So let's turn Romeo on. I'm going to turn I forgot, I can't remove that from the face because then y'all can't hear me. I learned, I'm learning. I'm finally learning how this all works. And it didn't take me five minutes to figure it out. Thanks, Katrina. Yes, please be sure to like the video. All right, let's turn Romeo on. Thank you, Vern. 
Up designs, you didn't get to watch it. Um, yeah, you better make sure to have tissues ready. <laughs> Um, Katina, we're making a doormat, but I'm trying out Romeo for the first time cutting tonight. And I want to see if I can use a 24 by 24 mat that I um, taped together. <laughs> Let's see. All right, I'm going to lift my roller up. Come on, Romeo. Let's show our friends what we can do. Scoot you up. I'm gonna have to hold it in the back because it's not large enough for the back. Okay. Let's put it in. Oh my gosh. Okay. I'm nervous. All right. Put the mat down in place. I'm gonna do a little test cut because I had tested this material already, but I um didn't test it with a mat. So I tested it with, oh, did I? Oh, I did test it with the mat. No, I did. Okay. Whew. Let's see if this works. All right. Actually, I'm going to, I'll just do a cut just, just in case. Let's do a little test cut, Romeo. Let's see what we got here. If this works, I'm moving that out of the way because it's knocking it. Is that good? It might even be a little bit high. Hopefully I didn't cut where it needs to be on the mat. I'm gonna go this way. Okay, I'm just doing a test cut. It's like really, it's like so. All right, it's like cutting really through the paper. All right, Romeo, what are you doing? Should we just try it? All right, let's try it. Let's start over here. All right, so we're going sideways. I think I have all the parts covered that need to cut. Let's see. We don't need to mirror it. Romeo, are you going to perform and do right? Let's see. Send to cutter. I'm going to hold this back part. And see if this works. Uh-oh. What are you doing? He stopped. Oh, you don't like going over that far, Romeo? What's wrong? All right, we'll start right there. It like got over there and then stopped at the edge. Oh, because I'm making him go too far over. He won't. Ah! What can I do? Let's see. Sorry, Romeo. How about here? Will you cut here? All right. Let me try again. I'm making him go too far over to the right. And he's like, no, I'm not doing that. Okay, so that's not gonna work. It's too big to go there. So let me go back to my design. It needs to be a little bit smaller. I know, Patrick, where are you? I'm, Romeo, I stopped. Okay, let's, Let's go back. It's Crafty Tuesday. We're gonna go back here. Let me edit. I'm gonna undo because I wanna go, I wanna make sure that they're both the same size. So let's group them together. And 28 is a little too long. So how about What's that? 20. I really wanted it to work. 26. All right. Move you out of the way. Don't not staying long. And then we'll turn this again. But it's not all the way down in that corner now. So hopefully this. Hopefully this will work. 
Let's move that off the mat. So now let's send the design. We're going to send to our cutter and click yes. Oh, wait, hold on. I'm sure. That's all the way up. I didn't go back down. <laughs> send to cutter. All right, this looks like it's not going to work. Even when I made it smaller, I might just have to do 24. I was just hoping I could turn to the side and make it um, larger and tape them or put the mats together. I was just making it harder than it needed to be. That was it. Trying something out. All right, so I'm gonna do one more time. That's it's the 24 inches. Oh, that doesn't even have to be tilted. <laughs> that doesn't even have to be tilted, but let's just see. Send design, send, send to cutter. Oh, oh. come on, Romeo, go back over there. All right, not working. Mommy was like, you just got me. Why are you doing me so dirty? Like, why are you acting like this? I just wanted to see, Romeo, what you could do. You don't want to do that, fine. All right. Let's just tilt it this way. We're going to do just 24. Is that straight? I'm trying to get that. So you see the degrees up here? I need that to be zero so I know that it's totally straight. All right. Well, I guess we'll just do the 12 by 24 mat. Let's switch it right here. So I'm 12 by 24. Let's move it onto the mat. All right. Seems still kind of long. I'm just trying to make sure it's all the way on the mat. Okay, so I'm gonna take this off. Romeo was not a fan of my hack and going sideways. That's okay. That's okay, Romeo, I still love you. So, let's undo these mats. Never done the freezer paper, so I was curious. What did you say, Roseanne? What about the freezer paper? The ghetto? <laughs> Romeo's like, no, 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 no. We are classy around here. I don't know what you're trying to do, but it's not going to work. That's not how I roll. Fine, Romeo. I'm a little classy, a little hood, whatever. Thought you could come to my side. Romeo said, no, thank you. He's like, do you know I'm from Italy? I'm from Italy. Um, I was wondering, I would have the shiny side down because it, it's more likely to stick on the mat and the heat, but someone can correct me. Yes, I do have the shiny side down. And then I'll be using the heat press to um, put that down. Don't even need that mark. All right. Freezer paper going down. I'm going to cut it off on the edge over here. Shiny side down. I'm anxious to see the freezer paper work. 
I use, um, what did I use? Before, I used paint one time, and I used um, prep that flex, flex seal another time. I didn't think the flex seal worked as well as my paint, but maybe I just didn't put enough on it. Not sure, but I didn't like it as much. All right, put this down. Well, I've never done the freezer paper, so we're gonna see if it's easier than the vinyl. All right, Romeo. Hopefully we can play nicely now. Let's push this back. Are we on the mat? We are on the mat. Okay, Romeo. HTV was disastrous. I agree that <laughs> it was not good for me. Um, hold on a sec. Let's see if I can get this to print. All right, send design. We're going to send and send to cutter. All right, Romeo. Oh, push the button again. I always forget to push that button the second time. He's like, so this is more my speed. Get it together, Courtney. It still seems like the pressure, it's like cutting right through this thing. Let me turn it down even more. All right. It's working. Let me get back and see the comments. All right, I'm excited about this. I hope it's gonna work well. Let's see what you guys are talking about. Cam's kind of, paint comes in more colors than Flex Seal. Yeah, and I'm using the outdoor paint. I'm sorry, I didn't realize I was totally in your way. If you want to see Romeo work. I just wanna make sure I'm holding the mat so it doesn't bang into the back. Uh, Flex Seal was like a dream. I only oversprayed because I didn't cover my entire mat. I used the brush, oh, brush on Flex Seal. I've never used that. I'm excited because I had this design out on my door for a long time and then when we did the construction, it got all messed up from the, the construction workers. All right, I don't know what it's, I think it's cutting, I think it's cutting, all right. Hi, Latricia. You used the paper when you made for a doornap party and it worked fine. Well, good. I am happy to hear that. Yeah, I've never done this. So we did find out uh, just now, Romeo doesn't like to be cutting to the side like that. I tried out something new. He would prefer to just cut straight on. It was going over too far to the right, so that wasn't working. But look at Romeo, I'm so excited. Hopefully I have enough space. I think it's on the mat. I think we're good, it's going all the way up to the top. Oh my gosh, I'm excited. Never seen the paint on Flex Seal. I haven't either, I'm gonna look for it though. So I've heard that the Flex Seal works really well. All right, are you done, Romeo? You didn't go back to the beginning. I thought you always went back to the beginning. I guess not. All right, Romeo is finished. Let's move that back. All right. Now, I will remove this from the mat. Let's flip it over here. And I'm trying to remove carefully so I don't tear the letters. It's coming off pretty easily. I'll just 
hope it it cut nicely and then it will lead nicely. Oh, in the middles of the letters, I'm gonna to need to take those out and save them because I'm just making a stencil here. Oh man, it looks like some of the parts did not cut as nicely as they should have. Hmm. Now, like I said, this is my first time using Romeo. I He might need some extra love. He might need to be calibrated. I don't even know. I just plugged him in. <laughs> I just plugged him in. It looks like maybe I should have used a little more pressure cutting. I had it like on a two. I think that was too low. It just down here, it looked like it was just going to tear right off. Like I was nervous that I had too much, but all right, I think I need some more. I'm going to do too much work on my self cutting this out without and I'm going to turn the pressure up a little bit on Romeo. I'm going to try and cut it one more time. You know, I don't really know how Romeo works yet. How fickle he is. again because it just seems like it's going to take a lot to weave that out and what's the point of having a cutting machine if you're going to have to cut that's not what we want all right Romeo we're going to do one more time I'm going to turn the pressure up I don't think I had enough pressure one more one more time it's pretty fast once we start painting so shouldn't be a big deal all right putting the pressure down or putting the mat down let's put the pressure up a tad and then I'm just going to press play because if you press play, it just cuts the same thing that you cut previously right here on the control panel. So I'm just going to do play and then I'll start again. All right, I think that seems better. All right, what do we have here in the comments? Be sure to use Juliet tomorrow. I definitely am using Juliet tomorrow. I'm not messing around with new machines on that competition. <laughs> yeah, but, oh my gosh, see? I think that's too hot. It's like tearing it up. Alan has Romeo, so we are going to see how everything goes tomorrow. <laughs> Is that coming out better? Okay, this one is, that's much better. So I have it on five right now. Is that weeding there? All right, that's weeding a lot better. Yeah, I had it on like two before. That was definitely not enough. Let's see. Finally got her Romeo. I did. Oh, Christiana, you made a doormat today. What did you um what did you use to make it? HTV or did you do the freezer paper method? Oh, hi Denzel. Welcome. Let's see who's here. Christiana, Marissa, hi. 
Is anybody here new that has never been to Crafty Tuesday? You got some to make a mat, never got around to it, Nanette? I did not find the spray until after the fact. Slice into sections and tape together, not my first one. It's like really, yeah, Romeo, he's not being used to mark the competition. He's just, he just cut up some stuff. I don't know what he's doing. Oh, I know what he's doing. My mat is moving. What the heck? My mat is like moving over. Oh my goodness gracious, look at this. It's like cutting everything here. The mat is moving over. All right, you know what? It looks like Romeo needs some help. <laughs> Romeo, oh Romeo. You got me messing up over here. I did, I did, didn't I? I thought I closed the lever. I don't know, Kristen. Maybe I didn't. Ah. All right, I'm going to do it this way. I really thought I closed the lever. But Juliet, I don't even know if Juliet works with this cord. I plugged her in with Romeo's cord. Let's see if it's interchangeable. Looks like it is. What's this? All right. Oh. Romeo's giving me problems tonight. Courtney, this is not a competition and there is no time restriction. Well, excellent. I am happy to hear that. And this is Crafty Tuesday. You know, like I said, I've never used freezer paper for a doormat. This is my very first time doing that. I have a whole roll of freezer paper. So... We're good, and you guys are patient, so I appreciate it. <laughs> I'm hoping by the end of tonight, though, I will have a doormat. That's the goal. That is the goal. But we're gonna have to use Juliet, because Romeo, I gotta figure him out. Just, to, I, I mean, I think he works basically the same, but he's giving me some problems right now. Make sure that this is below so it doesn't get caught on there. All right, Juliet. The boyfriend is not acting right right now. You're probably mad I used him anyway. All right, let's do a little test cut, see what we got with you. What are we set to? Oh, 20, that's gonna be way too high. We'll try, should we try 10? Julia, I didn't even cut through, what's going on? Okay, that one's good. So we'll keep it at 15. Let's go back down to the start. And you and I go way back, Julia. So let's do this right. But I am going to have to send it to a different machine. I've got um, Juliet chosen for my machine. So let's see, I need to go to manage cutters, go to Juliet, send design, 
send to Cutter. All right, Juliet, let's go. Hello, Micah. Sure. Micah just arrived back home. Oh, it says software cost connection abort. Let me see. Maybe that's because it doesn't want Romeo's cable. Let's plug in Juliet's cable. Okay. Juliet's cable is plugged in. We're using Juliet. It says it's connected. Make sure it's connected to the Wi-Fi. It is. Mm -hmm. All right, send to cutter. Juliet, let's go. Can't open device. It's saying it can't open it. Where is Patrick? Why is he not here? Um, I don't know, guys. Don't know what's going on. I am connected to Juliet, connected with Wi-Fi. Let me make sure that her Wi-Fi, unable, oh, unable to join network. So let's see if maybe, maybe she got disconnected when I connected Romeo last night. Oh, that's, it's on somebody else's network. How did that happen? That's not even my network that it was connected to. Well, that would do it. That would do it. So I'm it's scanning the network right now. There's my network. Why on earth would it? Let's see. Get my pet. Try to see. Okay, we are, it's connecting now. That's very strange. If you're just joining, I'm working on making a doormat. I'm having a few issues. It's Crafty Tuesday, issues happen. It says no connection. Why? Hmm. Juliet doesn't even want to connect to my network right now. Password. I thought we were about to be good. Am I connected to my Wi-Fi? Right, that is my Wi-Fi. Zero. All right, just trying to connect again. Connect, Juliet. Please, pretty please with sugar on top. I'm making a doormat, I can't make it without you. No connection. I wonder if I am connected to Wi-Fi. I am connected to Wi-Fi. Hmm. I wonder, is my password wrong? Where's my router? Maybe I should see. I'm sorry, guys. This is not working out. Let me, um, let me run downstairs and see, see what my password is. I really thought this was the password. Let me go through real quick. Let me get the password so we can connect Juliet.
password was right. Oh, it connected. I didn't even do anything. Oh my goodness gracious. All right. Connected to, now let's send to the cutter. Confirm. That was weird. It's cutting now. I don't know what happened. All right, friends, let me come back to the comments. Let's see. We're talking about software. It was, yeah, it was set on Juliet, but I don't know what the problem was. Two blank doormats are bought on Amazon. They're pretty reasonable. I've not started the project yet. Need to get busy. Yes, you do, Roseanne. You have to choose which one. So it was set up for. Um, it was set up for Romeo, but I did switch it to Juliet, and it wasn't working. Limited connection with your Wi-Fi. Oh, maybe. I've never had a problem. I mean, we connect a lot of devices here at the house, so I don't know. Let's see. Oh, does it default? Sometimes might not, hence. Oh, I didn't know that it defaulted to the machines. Wi-Fi can be weird like that. Yes, it can. So my mat is ready right here. When we are ready to do it. Who is um doing a party? Any ideas for that? Half my time's Facebook group. Courtney has no group page for me to spam. <laughs> I don't. I just can't keep up with all the stuff I need to keep up with already. Like, I feel like if I had a Facebook group, it would be hard for me. Like, I'd be a terrible group leader. <laughs> Y'all be like, want me to be in there. And I'm like, oh, I don't even know how to get into Facebook. I'm not the best with Facebook. All right, let me get my easy press so we can get warmed up. Anybody know what the easy press should be set to? I didn't even remember to check that. What temperature should it be on? I'm not sure. You can just spam my IG and just send me messages. I just don't have a group. <laughs> All right. Let's see. Third time's a charm. Oh, looky, looky. Oh, I don't even need the middles. I'm like trying to save the middle. I don't need the middle. the middles but let's place this on our mat have moderators for your group Courtney I do need moderators that's what Patrice told me 
All right, I need to find a moderator. Uh-oh, what happened here? Did that not cut out? Um, looks like it didn't. I'll just cut that part. Did it like move over there or something? I'm not really sure. We're having a, a machine difficulty day. <laughs> All right. It's coming together though. It's coming together. So maybe I will press this on first. Ah, uh, <laughs> you don't need a Brazilian messages. You can share all your cool ideas with you. You know what? It's funny. I actually, start, I created a group. I just haven't told anybody how I have it. It's the crafty crew. I have a group. All right. Maybe I'll share it with you guys. Maybe I need a group. I need a moderator too. Oh, 305 to 315. Okay. Oh, so many things guys. So many things. You would help her? You would help me? Because I need all the help I can get. I really do. It's, all this stuff is like overwhelming to me. Would you guys believe that prior to the Crafty Brick, I never posted on social media? <laughs> like ever? It just wasn't, it's just not really my thing. All right. All right, I think this might work, guys. Just took us a little longer. Just a little longer. Which one of oh, the shiny side goes there? trying to get these middle pieces. Let's see. She's holding out on us the group is secret. Yeah, it's so secret that no one has come there. <laughs> I've told nobody about it. Because somebody else told me I should have a group and I was like, okay, okay, I'll, I'll get a group. And then I was like, no, I don't want a group. <laughs> so I created it and then just never told anybody about it. But it is true, I would love to see all the creations that you guys do. And I guess that's the only way I can really do it. All right, get the, all the mills of these letters in here. Hopefully they'll press on. I don't know if I have to like stick them on. I would be on Facebook for that. You'd come, you guys would come to my group. I don't want to have a group with like five people in it. <laughs> All right, I'll do a Facebook group. Really, I, I obviously I don't need to do one. I'll just tell you guys my Facebook group. But this is my year. I start with, oh, you're starting with a YouTube channel? Miss C, you got a YouTube channel? Let me see, I'm going to see what the name of my group is that I already set up. <laughs> Let's see. Groups. Oh, yeah. The Crafty Crew. There it is. Okay. Oh, my gosh. Should I really do that? I have, there's nothing in there. Okay. There's one member. It's just mine. All right. Let me share. I'm going to share the link with you guys. Copy link. Oh my gosh, I'm about to have a, a, a crew or a Facebook group. All right, copy and paste. You guys, here's my Facebook group. Let's enter, create a whole new following. There it is. That's my Facebook group, guys. Now, okay, I'm okay. I'm not gonna be nervous. I'm not gonna be nervous, you guys. 
are not going to be upset if I'm not there like every single day. But you guys can share your projects there. I cannot believe I already set it up. Now, I don't have a group. I don't even know how the groups work, but I'm, we're going to work on it. All right, Miss C, practice, you're right. With practice, we're going to figure it out and get over our fear. Let me get my Teflon sheet. I don't even know if I need it, but I feel like it couldn't hurt. But I am going to take, I don't want those middles to move out of the plate, out of the, out of place. So I'm just going to move them for now while I press this down. Do I have, do I have to put a Teflon sheet on or can I just press? I don't really know. Help me out. Do I have a middle for the D and had? Um, thank you for checking. Is, oh, that's the O. Maybe this D, maybe that will work. Yes, I do. Thank you for catching that. You just joined my group. Thank you. Oh, I have to accept you all before this live ends. Okay. Okay. Tina, I'm, I'm nervous with you. I'm nervous with you. Courtney needs YouTube money for projects. I do need that YouTube money. All right, y'all tell me, do I need to put a Teflon sheet or will it burn? I'll just, I'll start it like this and we'll see. Oh my gosh. Okay, you guys are all requesting to be in my group. Oh, wow. I'm gonna leave here with the Facebook group. Leave my live with the Facebook group. Let's see if this is pressing down. Oh, wait, is it? Not for real. Hopefully I'm pressing on the right side. Maybe I need... Let's see what it does without. Okay. Oh, wow. I'm making a doormat with Um, freezer paper. Taking those middles out. Oh, why do I get so nervous, y'all? I don't need to be nervous, right? You guys are just, it's all friends just here crafting. That's all it is. You say yes to Sev Teflon? <laughs> I already said no. <laughs> I already said no to Teflon. Oops. I'm moving these middles out of the way because I just don't want them to get lost. And then I'll put them on after. All right, well, is it working? It doesn't really seem like it's like staying on there for real. Maybe I need higher. Okay. Hey, Breezy Bree. Breezy in the house. Welcome to Crafty Tuesday. So I don't know, is this supposed to like really stick to it? I'll put this all on. All right, and then I'm gonna put the middles through. I might have to stick those in, cause I don't know. Wow, I think it's working, guys. All right, there's my H. My little Y down there, I'm gonna put the Y and the O's. Let's see, what was this one? Yeah, I don't know that it's like really sticking. I think I need some, um, what do I need? Some little pins to stick that in. That was the O, and that was the A.
And what's this one? This is, what's that? <laughs> kind of forgot what they all are. Oh, that's the D. So where are my other ones? This is, the other part of the O. I'm missing my A. I think that's the only one. Oh no, my E too. All right, E and A. All right, I feel like I want to get my easy press, the, the mini one. I feel like that would do better. Where are you, easy press? Where's your cord? There we are. Lots of cords back here. Oh, and watch. I saw a watch cord that I was missing. All right, let's turn this on. And some of these might work. I think I'll get, I'll get the middle of this A here. Form another one that we messed up on. And I need this A. Okay, I got all the middles. I'm just waiting for the easy. I don't really like the big press. <laughs> it's bugging me. All right. Yeah. The, oh, Christiana, you are. We, I was already there. Perfect. Hold those in place. Oh, it just holds it in place. Okay, so it doesn't stick to it. All right. To push down small parts. I am ready for the crafting camp coming up. I'm actually super excited about it. Um, my class is how to um, how to improve your photos and videos with just your phone. Like, so you don't have to spend a lot of money on an expensive camera. Um, so I'm very excited to share about that. I actually, where's this? It feels like it's very cloudy. Oh, that's better. That's actually one of the lessons in my in my video. Like if your phone looks cloudy, it's probably because there was oil on it from your hands and stuff. Yeah, I just like my mini press for a lot of things, a lot. It, I feel like it just gives you more control over stuff. I have something in my hand one minute, lost the second. I'm, or the next minute, I'm telling you, that's me. That's the story of my life. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited for this. All right, I think the mini is definitely better. Okay, you guys can still see, okay. Just pressing all these down. I think I still need to um, maybe pin them down just so they don't move. Oops, that's stuck on there. I guess I had that tilted the wrong way. <laughs> All right, let me get some of my little push pins. Donde esta? Where are my pins? Oh, here they are. Here they are.
And then I'm just going to use my brush. So really this project probably took a lot longer than it needed to, but we had some technical difficulties with our cutting machine. But if you're a crafter, you know that that can always happen. <laughs> So the whole point of Crafty Tuesday, that's what it's all about. Mistakes and figuring things out. So I just wanna secure these middle parts before I put my paint on. Let's see if you guys are having any suggestions. I have a bunch of you to approve. Oh my gosh. Okay, I'm approving everybody before I get off. Wow, I'm gonna have a Facebook group. You guys, I have seriously just been so nervous about doing it. I think I created it, I don't know, like a, months ago. Months. I just never told anyone about it. <laughs> you guys are my first people in my Facebook group. So now I have to put the Facebook group in my description also of my YouTube videos so people can join and then you guys can show me all your projects, but I will go and um, approve everybody. All right, I think we're ready for paint. I'm gonna put some pens in this part, just so that end can kind of stay where it's supposed to stay. Oh, I forgot to do the middle of the U. Okay. Here we go. Okay. Do moderator so they don't spam your group, Courtney. Okay, I will. I will, I will. So how do you guys do moderators? You just like ask your friends to be moderators? They spam your group a lot. I don't want them to spam my group. And some thick old paint. All right, we are Painting our doormat. Whoa. Get, this is like kind of coming up, but I mean, I think it's gonna be fine. Excited for this. Finally get my doormat back on my front porch. And I don't really think like when are you gonna leave, but <laughs> it cracks me up. So it's people like always commented on it. They were like, your doormat is funny. <laughs> I'm like, you I do care when you leave. <laughs> you you can head out in just a minute. I already got my dinner made tonight. Did a little crock pot dinner. We got some chicken tortilla soup. So we are good to go. Scott's not gonna burn the house down. So it's all good. Just click on people and add as moderators. Not hard, Courtney, you got this. They have to join to add as a moderator. Okay. All right, you guys are gonna help me through this. I'm gonna go in and see so many people in my group.
Oh, and I'm so excited to see your see projects. That's going to be fun. Cause I already love when, when you guys send me, um, images of your stuff, you, people send me messages and I love to see them. I need some more paint. Which I guess I can just do it this way. Kristen, did you see that I got finally got the um, the Maker's Magic? It came last week. I haven't tried it yet, but I'm very excited to test it out. I think I'm going to try it out with my um, one of my glitter glitter wine glasses. That's going to be my first project with it. And this turns out nicely. I get so focused when I'm working on something. Are you guys excited about that metallic puff from Caesar? I was on their live this morning. I actually have made some shirts with it. It is so cool. Very, very cool. And Alan and I are actually using it tomorrow on the challenge for our project. I'm trying to make sure I get all the little spots. My goodness, you guys helped me through this. You guys helped me through every Crafty Tuesday project. I appreciate you. You're so patient with my mess ups. I gotta get Romeo figured out. He is definitely not coming on the challenge tomorrow. I really thought it was just gonna be exactly like Juliet, but it looks like it's not exact. Similar, but not exact. Let's see. Shocked by that product, let's see. Oh, metallic puff on orders, orders as soon as you got home. Oh my gosh, it is amazing. Did you get both colors? Or did you get the gold or the silver? I've tried the gold and the silver, and I've been very happy with both. It's easier to watch and tell you than us do it. Wait, what would, watch and tell me what? Oh, just anything? <laughs> All of my projects? <laughs> Courtney, you should do this. You should do this. But I appreciate all the suggestions. I do, I do. Breezy, did I see you say something? Oh, you're talking to Roseanne. Talking to Roseanne. All right, we are almost at the end. And then I can take the paper off. So yeah, this was definitely easier than, um, what do you call it? Than the, what did I use before? The HTV. That was not, not that easy. All right, my friend. So I guess if I don't have enough on there, then I can like go back right i can go back if i need to and like fix up some little parts 
gonna roll my sleeves up and what I want. I'm gonna get this cardboard to set it on. Get the cardboard to set it on. Baby shower signs. I need to order more of that acrylic. Yes, you do for sure. Oh, I, the middle of the H <laughs> messed up. I didn't have the middle of the H in a little bit. That's all right. Oh my goodness. I will bring the camera over so you guys can see it better. But, wow. Bring me a little towel. Do I have a little, oh, I got a little, little rag. You guys. Oh my gosh, look. It turned out really good. It's just that the middle of that H right there, I should have had, there's a little, um, a little piece that should have gone there, but. Oh, I'm excited. Let's move those out of the way. Yay! We made a mat! That sound was so satisfying. That looks so good. Thank you, guys. Wow. I'm very excited. Freezer paper worked out. Thank you so much. You like the H? Okay. They're supposed to have a little piece in there, but I think it definitely still works out. Wow. I just like, I'm just gonna look at it. I'm just gonna look at it because I just love it. Yay. What kind of paint did you use? Jennifer, I used this um, outdoor from Folk Art, outdoor, to, uh, outdoor acrylic ink. And I've used that before and it worked out really well. So I thought I would try it again. I think you really, really love it. I do. <laughs> I do. It's going on my porch tomorrow. Like, seriously. Thanks, Breezy. Okay. I'm going to my Facebook group right now. I'm going to accept all of you. Let's see. Notific see, I'm, I'm really not good with Facebook. So let me see where they are. Oh, okay. Oh, my gosh. Oh, I can just approve all, all at once. Approve all member requests. Confirm. You're all approved for my Facebook group. Oh, and Karen Green, you want to join too? Admin is, okay, I'm going to have to look through like how to do everything. Penny, Nanette, why didn't, oh my gosh, okay, I'm approving Lucille, Miss C, Jasmine. Vertisha, Roseanne, Christiana, Danny, Sweet Rose. You are all approved. You're in my group. I have a Facebook group now. <laughs> Who was first? I don't even know. <laughs> oh my gosh, I have a Facebook group. Freezer paper. Oh, the Facebook group name is The Crafty Crew. Let me, I'll put the link in again. Um, breezy. I just set it up. Well, I set it up like months ago and I was scared to have a Facebook group. So yeah, I don't even know what that means. If I put it up there, I don't think you can click on it. So I don't know. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Thank you guys. I have a Facebook group now. I have members in my Facebook group. I did a doormat. Romeo had to get pushed to the side for a moment. We got to figure him out. But Juliet came in clutch and helped us out. Yeah, the crafty crew. Thanks, D. Yeah, I totally thought about it. I'm like, what, what, was a, what would be a good name for my group? When I 
decide to have one. <laughs> you should link on the YouTube bio once you get it going into it. Okay, I will. You guys are the best, seriously. You make it so fun to come on here and y'all know, I mean, you know, I was nervous at first doing this, but you guys really make me not nervous. I, I'm so happy. You weren't approved. See, see, you need, let me see. Let me see, cause I'm approving all of you. Oh, I just got two notifications. Okay, let me see. Jennifer, Katina, Karen, you're all approved. You're the blue crafter. I haven't not approved anybody. So I think it's in there. I, you guys all should be in there now. Okay, Blue Craft, I have 17 people so far. Oh my gosh. <laughs> no, I have 20, I have 20 people now. My group is jumping. <laughs> oh my gosh. Yeah, frankly crafts. You need one, you need to make one. So I think that the freezer paper worked great. And um, yeah, freezer paper, pressing it on. And I think that's good. I think that's it. I mean, I was just having issues. The reason it took so long is because I was having issues with my machine. Oh, Breezy, you requested too? Oh my gosh, I can't believe it. Oh wait, what am I doing? Cancel. I don't want to leave my page. Danny Johnson. Oh, I don't know. Now I'm clicking things. I don't know where I'm going. Community chats. Oh, Danny Johnson. Is that breezy? I think I didn't know your name. Are you, how did I not know what your name was? I just always call you breezy. Whoo. Refresh, let's see, Re refresh if you keep the screen open. Yeah, y'all should y'all should make a mat, make a doormat. And I've heard that the Flex Seal works well. I just didn't think that it lasted as long as this paint. So I prefer the, um, the paint. Oh, Danny, oh, Danny, I did not know. Breezy, you know what's funny is um, they used to call me Breezy in high school. Um, cause I was, I ran track and they said I was fast. So they were like, you're breezing past people. So they called me breezy. That was my nickname. Okay. Sayini, it says you're a member. Thank you, Kristen. Thank you for checking that out. All right, Roseanne, I am going to get moderators for sure. So you guys said, I just, I can just ask, I can ask one of you in the group to be a moderator. Is that how it works? Oh my gosh. Look at that, I already have um, a picture. Christiana already posted in the group. Wow. Oh my gosh, you guys are like already commenting in my group. Thank you so, so much. And Christiana, those mats are fire. I love them. Wow, Where, did you get those from Home Depot? Frankly, Crafts, yours is going to be fabulous. You saw what I went through to get this. And, and you see I've got some mess ups. So I'm certain yours will be fabulous. Why don't you make one and then post it in the group so I can see it? <laughs> now I can see all the pictures. Yeah, don't be nervous. You're going to be accepting people all night. <laughs> I will. I'll be like, oh my gosh, I have a group. Kristen, you help. Thank you. Thank you. We came for the crafting and stayed for the Courtney. Thank you guys. Oh my gosh. Man, you guys are awesome. Thank you, Kristen. I'm going to ask you to see if you'll be a moderator in there when I figure out how to set it up. Um, so take a picture of your mat and put it, I'll oh, put it in the group. I will. And now I gotta tell people I have a group so we can share pictures. Oh my goodness. This was, this was a great night. Oh, and you got yours from Walmart, Misty. Okay, I need to get some of those. I've also, you know, I've got a big press now. So I think those will be pretty easy to make. 
I need some for my, my back doors. The back doors, my patio doors, I have two there and I need doormats there too. So I think I'll make those. This will be the front door and then I'll do those for the back doors. You posted your banner in the group? Well, let me see your banner. Let me refresh. What I'm seeing, oh my gosh. Create, I love it, Renee. All the tools, that's really cute. And Breezy with the sublimation. Oh my gosh, okay, I'm excited. Now I was super nervous about doing a group, but this is gonna be fun when I can like see y'all's creations. Thank, thank you for pushing me tonight to invite people to my group. <laughs> okay, definitely private for the group, okay. Oh, you guys are nice. We can ask crafting questions and give recommendations for supplies. I love it. Oh my gosh. Look, I've, I've just been nervous about this and here I am, I have a group now and I have some members. Wow. You guys are the best. You are the best. All right, friends. My husband, Kaya, just got home from volleyball. Let me remove this from the stage. We're going to um, go have dinner right now. But one more look at my mat. You can see it from up high. Yeah, the H doesn't look bad from afar. It's a, it's a Monet. <laughs> of course, it's messed up. But from afar, it's not bad. I, I like this a lot. I wish I wanted it to be a little bigger, but I, I couldn't do it. I mean, I could split it up. I could split it into two parts, but I don't want to do all that. Whew, thank you guys. All right. So yes, everyone be kind in the group. I think, I think I had that in there. It's definitely a nice group. If y'all are going to be mean, then you can, I'm going to have to kick you out because I only deal with niceness. So kind comments, even if you don't like somebody's project, Mm -mm. No, nothing mean. Okay. Um, Courtney takes a clue from Delanda. You do not have to answer all the questions. The group will help do that. Okay. That's good. That's good. Cause it's overwhelming to me. Oh yeah. My daughter's doing volleyball now. So for, this is her second year doing it. It's been very, very fun. Hey, Jesse, you have to catch the replay. Yes, good vibes only. You all know I, I'm spreading good vibes all the time. So you will not have any mean stuff in this group. I'm not about it. Mrs. C, want to see the mat? That's my mat. Miss C, I want to see your mat in the group. Who else was making a mat? Frankly Crafts, I want to see your mat in the group. Um, a volleyball with her name. She doesn't want anything that I make. No, I asked her, I'm like, I'm gonna make that for you. No, no thanks, no thanks. <laughs> oh my gosh. All right, well, thank you guys so much for being here tonight, for helping me, motivating me to get my group going and just being patient with me while I was having all those issues with the machine. I always get nervous, but you guys are just here and we're just chilling. So I'm very, I really, really appreciate you. Um, I will be, uh, be back here tomorrow for the crafty challenge with Alan. Breezy, I got it from Amazon. The link is in the description where I got it. Oh, wait, okay. So Nanette just posted. I just have to look at that real quick. Let me just look, see if any of y'all posted anything else. Oh, Kristen, I love those earrings. <gasps> wait, Missy, I love that. Y'all, Miss C made a doormat. I sent in the group. Look, and the net. The giant standing flowers behind my son. And oh my gosh, the last. Oh, I'm excited about this. I'm ex okay. Yeah, I'm going to be in this group a lot now. <laughs> I need to change the, the cover photo. I, I, I just like set it up. I set it up and also like, here's my group. So I need to do the details. But I will. I'll work on that. All right, thank you, D. Um, yes, catch the replay, Patrice. Wait, was Patrice here? Oh, hey, Patrice, I didn't even see you jump in, slide in at the end. Let me show you what I made, Patrice. Look, we made a doormat tonight. So fun. Romeo was giving me some problems, but Juliet came through. 
And I created a Facebook group, Patrice. They helped me figure it all out tonight. So things are good. My second live of the week. One more live tomorrow, 5 p.m. Pacific, 7 Central, 8 Eastern. Tomorrow night, be there or be square for the Crafty Challenge with me and Alan. We're going to be using the Caesar Metallic Puff. It's going to be fun. My record right now is, uh, what well, I'm, I've won three. One, two, yeah, I've won three, I've lost five. One, two, three. Yeah, three and five, not very good, but um, I've been having fun every single time. So that's all that matters, right? That's, that's what I tell myself. <laughs> Let me go, Joy. Thank you, Patrice. It's the, um, the Crafty Crew. Here's the, I'll put the link again in the, in the chat. So if y'all haven't joined my Facebook group, go join it. I just started it tonight. Um, I'll be back here tomorrow for the Crafty Challenge, and then I'll be back next week for Crafty Tuesday. I'm making something from um, the Dollar with Dollar Tree items. I have not figured out what that is yet, but I will know next Tuesday, and I will be here. Thank you guys for your support. I really, really, really appreciate you, and I'm going to post my picture in the group, too. I will see y'all tomorrow evening and next week. Until then... Stay crafty, my friends. Bye. See y'all later.